Hi, this is my 25-26 week update. So, a lot has happened, a lot of crazy stuff, <laughs> but I'm going to go ahead and update you guys on um, my symptoms first. Um, this week, of course, dry skin. It's been drier than normal. It's been like super dry. I put on all types of oils and greases on my belly and it's still dry. So, it's just starting to like fade just recently. Like, this is my collection of oils. I don't know if you can see it, but it's ridiculous. And I put all of that on my stomach and I still have dry skin. It's crazy. So, dry skin is just out of control. Um, my pelvic bone has been like in lots of pain and like burning. It's really intense. <laughs> And sometimes I can't walk. I just have to sit in the bed because it hurts so bad. It's crazy. Um, and then I can't sleep. Same old, same old. But I'm not getting any rest. But I found out that if I stay up really late, I sleep better. So I started going to bed at like 1 o'clock. And I'm sleeping for the most part through the night. I have to get up and pee. But I sleep through the night if I go to bed really, really late. So if you guys can't sleep, maybe you should go to sleep a little later. And I still have to get up early, but I just feel more rested. So, that's always awesome. Um, next thing I'm going to talk about is my cravings. I had a craving for banana cream pie. I don't know if you guys know about Baker's Square. They make the best banana cream pies. And they have little um, thinly sliced almonds on top. <sighs> to die for. So good. So, um, me and my sister went to the store and we got a banana cream pie. Um, and then I had a craving for Rice Krispie Treats, which I also made. They weren't the best, but it cured my craving. And banana splits. We've been going out for ice cream, like, every night. I know, it's horrible. But, like, I love any type of ice cream right now. Like, banana splits, ice cream, just anything. My other craving is Captain Crunch cereal. I can eat it all day. It's so good. So, like, I eat Captain Crunch cereal, banana splits, and banana cream pie. I think my baby's gonna like bananas. I hope he doesn't hate them because I'm eating so much banana stuff. That would suck. So, those are my cravings. Nothing really mm, exciting. Okay, so the new news is um, I have a doctor's appointment tomorrow. So, I'll find out what little Carter is doing in my belly. Um, I also am gonna be getting my RH Romagam shot. Um, because I have A negative blood, I have RH negative, and it'll fight the baby's blood, so I have to get that shot this week, either this doctor's appointment or my next one, because it has to be before 28 weeks, so we'll see when I get that. And I had my photo shoots. I'm so excited. It came out really great. I absolutely love the pictures. So when I get the pictures in, I'll go ahead and I'll post them for you. Um, and make a little slideshow. I think you guys are going to really like them. They came out awesome. I'm so happy. And then I got the henna on my belly done last week. If um, you didn't see it yet, I posted a video with the henna on my belly and what my baby's name is. So you can go look at that video and kind of see what happened. Um, what else is happening? I went to Once Upon a Child. I don't know if you guys have this where you guys are, but it's basically like a consignment shop for kids for like infants all the way up to like preteens like maybe 12 13 and they sell used clothes some of the stuff in there is brand spanking new um it's all really cheap it's like five dollars three dollars two dollars so nothing's like over ten dollars i think not even the coats and jackets so everything there was super affordable so i got them a couple outfits and i'll show them behind me in a second and then after thanksgiving um City Trends had layette sets on sale. And the layette sets came with blankets, two onesies, hoodies, um, a hat, bibs, a whole bunch of stuff. So I'll show you all that too. So that was really cool. Um, what else did I buy? Um, that's about it. I'm going to buy my diapers next week. And I'm going to compare for you guys, like, the Target brand and the Diapers.com brand, just so you can see, like, the difference, I guess, in generic diapers. Um, 
Because I don't want to like pay a whole bunch of money on really expensive diapers. If the generic ones work the same and I get more, I'm going to buy the generic ones. So, uh, I'll show you guys that. I'll make a special video just with like diaper comparisons. <laughs> Weird, I know. But it should be, you know, a little learning experience. Um, and what else? Oh, I went and did my baby registry. Yay! So I went to Target and Babies R Us. And then I registered online at Amazon.com because... Amazon had everything I wanted and when I saw they had a baby registry I was super happy and I could just email it to everybody instead of um, you know waiting for the invitation to come for the baby shower invitation um, so that was cool so my baby shower is going to be on Super Bowl Sunday go Bears okay so on Super Bowl Sunday I'm going to have like a baby shower slash Super Bowl party so that should be really fun so welcome little Carter so I'm excited about that. I wish my friends could be there, but family school too. Um, what else happened? Oh, I bought these CDs and they're the Rockabye Baby CDs. I don't know if you guys are familiar with them, but I got Kanye West and Green Day and they're basically like their songs remixed and baby lullabies. It's really cool. Um, I can show them to you really fast. Hold on. I got my this is what they look like. So, this is the Green Day one. And if you look on the back, it has the different songs. And then this is the Kanye West one. And on the back of his has different songs too. So I'm really excited about these. Like, I hope that he likes them. It'll be something different, something fun, so he doesn't have to listen to, like, boring lullaby music. These are, like, cool lullabies. So, that's neat. Okay, so I'm going to show you some of the stuff you got. So, this is what I got from Once Upon a Time. It's little pants, and it goes with this shirt, and it says, Mommy Loves Me. And it also has a long sleeve shirt, and it just has a lion on it, like that. Then, he has this hoodie, which is really cute. And this is part of a layout set. So, it's the hoodie, and then you have these two t-shirts. And you have these pants. And it came with a hat and a bib, but it's not over here. And with this little blanket. Isn't that a lot? And it was only like $15, so good price. And then this is another Leia set where you have little pants. And then you have this long sleeve onesie. And then the blanket. So that's cool. And then this is the last layout set. And you got the same thing. So it's like the two t-shirts. Um, a hoodie. And little pants. And this one came with a hat. So it was cute. And then this is what I found at Once Upon a Time. And it's like little sweater pants. And a little sweater top. Isn't it cute? And it was brand new. And it was only $5. Awesome, right? And then this is his Bears paraphernalia. Go Bears! And then he has this one. Go Bears! So, definitely going to be a Bears fan. And these are his little Bears PJs. They're kind of big, but you can always wear them sometime. And then this is the last thing I got him. It's just something that's really warm. It's like really thick. And it has long sleeves. And it came with this little coat almost. It's really thick, just to keep them nice and warm. So that's just some of the stuff that I got them. Um, just cute little stuff. I didn't pay too much money for it. Like, most of the stuff came from Once Upon a Time. It was like $3, $2. Really super cheap stuff. So, that was good. Um, I'm going to order my baby shower invitations next week. Well, my pictures should be in the mail at the end of this week. So, sometime around next week or this week. I'm going to order those and get those out, and I'll show you guys once I get them. And I think they're going to be super cute, so I'm really excited about that. What else? I'm looking at notes. That's why I'm looking down here. Um, I think that's about it. I want to say congratulations to Letty76, um, Sharita88, and Baby Vlog. They all had baby girls. So, congratulations. And I think the baby's names are Hazel, Kamora, 
and Willow. Oh, and um, uh, Tyron, I'm not sure what her YouTube name is. She also had her baby girl, Emery. So congratulations to all of you guys. I'm so happy for you. Lots of baby girls, like millions. I guess all the baby boys are coming like when I have my baby in March. That's weird. Um, that is about it. So I will update you guys again in about a week or two. So just stay posted and I'm going to show you my belly and then we'll be all done. So let me show you the belly. Okay, so this is the belly sideways. And this is the belly forward. Belly. Then This is the belly forward. You can still kind of see my head out a little bit. It's kind of faded. Like, she looks really close. And a shadow on my belly. See? You can see it a little bit. But it's been like almost two weeks. So it's kind of faded. And then this is my belly sideways. And I'm not that big yet. You know, I'm like a decent size. And then I'm just going to measure. See how much bigger I've gotten. Since last week. Ooh, it's cold. So I'm at about 37 and a half. So I think I grew like an inch. So exciting! So that's pretty much everything. Oh, and I don't look like a bum in this video. Yay! Because usually when I do my YouTube videos, I do them right before I'm about to go to sleep. So I always have on like PJs and I look all bummy, but I just got off work and decided to do it. So that works out. Well, thank you all for watching. I really appreciate it. And look for my photos in week 27 soon. And thanks for watching. Bye.